Welcome, curious minds, to another captivating episode of Mind Library. Today, we embark on an intellectual expedition into the realm of human nature, guided by the brilliant insights of cognitive psychologist Steven Pinker and his seminal work, The Better Angels of Our Nature. Prepare to be amazed as we uncover the depths of human behavior, exploring the evolution of violence and the forces that have shaped our world. If you're hungry for insights that challenge perceptions and reshape perspectives, you're in for an intellectual feast. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss an exploration into the depths of wisdom. 1. Setting the stage. Picture a world where violence and brutality seemed to reign supreme. But hold on. Pinker's revolutionary perspective challenges this perception. He asserts that despite the seemingly chaotic history, humanity has actually been gradually becoming less violent over the centuries. This fascinating concept challenges our assumptions and forms the foundation of the better angels of our nature. Imagine a time when early human tribes fought fiercely over limited resources. Survival depended on dominating neighboring groups. But, consider this, Pinker reveals that as societies developed agriculture and settled down, they had a vested interest in reducing violence. Shared resources and cooperation became more valuable than conquest. 2. The civilizing process. How did our species transition from brutal hunter-gatherer conflicts to the intricate web of civilization? Pinker introduces the concept of the civilizing process, where societal changes like the rise of agriculture and the establishment of legal systems gradually reduce the frequency and severity of violence. Through vivid examples, we witness the birth of a more peaceful world. In ancient times, vengeance was a common response to conflicts. Pinker cites Hammurabi's Code, one of the earliest known legal systems, as a turning point. Instead of escalating revenge, this code sought proportional justice, fostering a sense of fairness and a move away from brutal cycles of retaliation. 3. The Humanitarian Revolution Prepare to be inspired by the Humanitarian Revolution, a period marked by incredible shifts in attitudes towards cruelty. Pinker showcases how art, literature, and the collective conscience influenced humanity to embrace empathy and compassion. From the Renaissance to the modern human rights movements, we uncover the transformative power of ideas. Renaissance art transformed perceptions of humanity. Pinker references paintings depicting human suffering that stirred compassion and empathy. Consider Michelangelo's The Peter, which depicts the Virgin Mary cradling the lifeless body of Jesus, evoking deep emotions and laying the groundwork for a more compassionate worldview. 4. The Long Peace and Beyond Have you ever heard of the Long Peace? Pinker delves into the era post-World War II, where major power conflicts significantly decreased. With meticulously gathered data and compelling narratives, we explore the mechanisms behind this decline and the role of international organizations in maintaining global stability. The Cold War era was rife with geopolitical tensions. Yet, in this period, the superpowers recognized the catastrophic consequences of full-scale nuclear war. The concept of mutually assured destruction contributed to a strategic shift, highlighting the importance of diplomacy and peaceful coexistence. 5. The Inner Demons and Angelic Forces It's time to dive into our own minds. Pinker examines the interplay of our innate tendencies, the inner demons, with our cognitive and emotional capacities, the angelic forces. By understanding how our brains function, we gain insights into the roots of aggression and the potential for kindness. This section reveals the complexity of human nature. Our brains have evolved to be both reactive and reflective. Pinker uses brain scans to illustrate how the amygdala, responsible for fear and aggression, interacts with the prefrontal cortex, linked to decision-making and empathy. Understanding this dynamic sheds light on our capacity to control impulsive violence. 6. Navigating the present and future As we stand at the crossroads of history, Pinker urges us to consider the factors that can sustain and even enhance the decline of violence. With the power of technology, global connectivity, and the lessons of the past, we have the tools to guide our world toward a more peaceful future. 
The internet has revolutionized global communication. Pinker points out that social media campaigns have played a role in raising awareness about humanitarian crises and rallying support for change. Platforms like Twitter and Instagram enable instantaneous connection across continents, mobilizing people to take action. Reflecting on our journey through Pinker's masterpiece, The Better Angels of Our Nature, we are reminded of the boundless potential within us to shape a more harmonious world. By acknowledging our capacity for change, learning from history, and fostering empathy, we can truly unleash our better angels and steer humanity toward a brighter tomorrow. Thank you, intrepid explorers of knowledge, for joining us on this captivating expedition through the pages of the better angels of our nature. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to Mind Library for more exhilarating journeys into the realms of wisdom. Until next time, keep seeking, keep learning, and keep embracing your better angels.